Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another brand new video. And this video is for all of my AMD users in this video. I'm gonna be showing you how you can set up your AMD Adrenaline software to improve your FPS and get better performance in gaming. So make sure to watch this video till the end. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video and let's get started. Gear Up Booster is one of the best programs for the optimization of your ping while you play games using your wired or wireless connection. So get this paid program free from my description and play your game with lower ping. First things first is getting the AMD Adeline software, which you can get it from the link in the description. Below this software will help you to update your graphic card drivers to the latest version, and it will also help you to set up your graphic card for gaming. You can simply click on the download now button and install the software naturally. What's wrong with that you have to simply right click on any empty area of your desktop and then select AMD software. In addition, right over here. And then in the home section, you have to look up for driver and software and click on check for updates to see if you're updated to the latest version. Once you admit that, you have to go over to the gaming section, then go over to the graphics section. And right over here, you'll find a Radeon Super Solution. You have to enable this thing and the shot and effect should be set to 75%. Right after that, you'll find AMD Fluid Motion Frames and Anti Lag. You have to enable both of them, and you have to disable the Boost Chill, Image Sharpening Enhanced V-Sync. Turn all of them off next is wait for Vertical Refresh. You have to set this thing to Always Off. Frame Rate Target Control. Set this thing to Disable Anti-Aliasing, a Use Application Settings, and the method should be set to Multi Sampling. Then Morphological Anti-Aliasing should be disabled. An asotropic filtering should be turned on, and asotropic filtering level should be set to 2x. A texture filtering quality. You have to set this into standard, and the surface format. Optimization should be set to enable. Installation mode should be EMD optimized and OpenGL triple buffering. And at the 10-bit pixel format, you have to disable both of them. And once you're done with that, do not forget to reset your shared cache. This is super important. Next thing to do is locate your display settings. And then away here, you have to enable AMD Freezing Premium. If this is available for your monitor, and then the GPU scaling should be turned on. Scaling mode should be set to preserve expect ratio. And integer scaling should be turned off. Now the best part comes over here is the color deck. For some monitor it will be only 8 BBC. But for some it can go up to 10. So you have to set the highest color. Depth of label for your monitor. Then with a the pixel format. Go with RGB and make sure that this is set to full RGB. Display color enhancement. You have to set this into disable and custom color. You have to enable this thing, and for the saturation set this into 150, because this will make your display look a little bit more vibrant, and the contrast should be set to 110. Right after that, go over to record and stream, and in the hair go. Go to the setting spot then you have to set a record, display, and show indicator both of them off. Then you have instant replay, insurance GIF, and in game replay, make sure to turn off all of them. After that go over to the performance section, and then go over to the tuning part. Over here you have to locate your GPU section, and then in tuning control, make sure this is set to default. In the AMD Smart Access Memory, make sure to enable that if that is available. For your PC it is not available for me, but this is super beneficial for your gaming. After that go to the setting spot, and make sure that high metric overlay during logging is turned on. Last in the smart technology. You have to once again find an AMD Smart Access Memory, and if this is available simply enable that as well. And once you're done with that, you are good to go. Download this AMD FPS Boost Pack from the link I give in the description. And in here, you'll find some of these commands from Fires. You have to right click and run this as administrator. All of them contains useful command from Fires that you do not have to run manually. It will be automatically done, so first one will disable the BCD Twix. Second one will disable your memory compression. Third one will disable process mitigation. And last one is for the input latency. All of them will help you to increase the performance of your graphic card. Second one is the RAM optimization, in which I have left a ton of preset. You can simply run the RAM that you're using. I currently use 30 to ZB RAM on my PC, so I need to run this one. But it could be different for you. So you can pick one from the preset once again. If you don't like it, you can always reset it back to default. Next one is the AMD GPU optimization folder, which contains all of the files that are really essential. For your AMD GPU, first one is the best GPU settings, second one is the SFIO priority, third one is disabling energy driver, fourth one is power thirdling, and lastly is the prioritized AMD GPU for gaming. I highly recommend you guys should double click and run all of these registry as this will help you for better performance of your graphic card. Last is the clean temporary files in which I have left local temp. You can control A and shift delete all of these files. Once again you cannot delete some of them because they're currently in use, so you have to skip all of them. After that, come to the second file which is the window stamp, and you have to do once again, shift delete all of these files, and continue to delete all of them. However, you can delete some of them so you can skip them. 
I hope this video helps you out, so make sure to like leave. and smash the subscribe button. Also you can check out channel membership if you guys want to support me out. Also leave your specs down in the comments below so I can help you guys with the best settings and visit you in another video until the stay tuned. Keep watching Adex and peace out.